All right, greetings, peace, and joy to all. Welcome back to Awoken Minds. If you are new to Awoken Minds and you digging the vibe, go ahead, hit the subscribe button, uh, like, share, uh, comment, however you may feel. And also, if I add a value into your life and you like to add value into my life, uh, there are two ways you can do it, which is through donation either via PayPal or Cash App. And those links are in the description below. And uh, every amount is greatly appreciated. And I thank you in advance. Okay, so when it comes to knowing yourself, having confidence and asserting yourself in the world, there's a certain thing or things or way that you have to feel in order to be the person who you truly are. So, if you have a, a business meeting or interview, if you have a uh, court hearing, if you have uh, a public speech, a uh, Announcement. I mean, if you have a public speech, um, uh, I guess a seminar or whatever, you know, if you uh, actually open up a new storefront business for the first time, you know, if you're, I guess, asking for a loan, whatever that may be. Um, if you're not confident in it, if you're not confident in yourself and have trust in yourself that you can do this, you're not going to do it. So how can we obtain confidence in our life? How can we improve ourselves in life? How can we grow in life? It's simple. You have to rehearse. You know, just as you're in a play. Life is a play. So, if you was desiring to take a woman of interest out, you know, on a, a, a lunch meeting, just to get to know her, and you're a shy person, you know, Maybe you should rehearse with yourself of how you will speak to that person. And if it gets too complicated, too much detail, start simplifying, start simplifying, start taking things out, start making it more simple, precise, and clear. And then say that precision and clear affirmation with confidence and then say it with extreme amounts of confidence to whatever woman you decided to go out on lunch with I'm just giving an example because the more you do something the better you become at it you know if you are doing or if you desire to get involved in public speaking the more you do it the more you get better at it the more you have confidence in it It'll be just as you doing a day-to-day -day routine that you do with a, a employer for some of you. Um, uh, it'll be just as if you're riding a bike. Once you know how to ride it, you ride it forever. Or some, some don't ride bikes, but I'll just give an example. So when you act things out you are making things more concrete into your life you know you are developing things about yourself uh, excuse me a second let's see okay I know that what time did I take that see 30 Boom, I think, let's see, 28, I think I'm over, 10 plus 28, yes, that's 18 minutes, 
give me a second, y'all. Let's see. I'm on my lunch break. Give me a second. Let's see. So we got 18 plus 12. So boom. So that's 20. That's 30. So I got a couple more minutes. So um, when you're constantly doing something, you develop this confidence about yourself. It comes more concrete into your reality. And what I know is personally about me, when you keep rehearsing and, and saying uh, things more clear and more precise, uh, things start to become more concrete. You develop more confidence. You uh, actually feel that power that you are <laughs> born with, you know. And uh, I feel like it's important for us to practice whatever we're not that good at, whatever we're not good at, whatever we learn. I feel it's good for us to practice you know if we uh are nervous about something we have to practice whatever we're nervous about so we can be better about it so this is how we develop confidence this is how we develop a strong uh, uh inner knowing of who we are and how we are going to operate on this planet how we move as the divine beings that we are you know, so it's important for us to constantly be practicing, constantly be doing something every day, every day to approve ourselves, either if it's just meditation, even if it's uh, fasting, even if it's eating right, even if it's uh, uh, whatever it is, getting to work 30 minutes early. You know, I'm just giving examples. You know, we have to improve ourselves if it's fitness, you know, set aside a blueprint and a schedule. And apply action and do that consistently. Turn into your daily ritual and become the greatness that you already are. But you have to discover it. May this video add value into your life, inspiration, empowerment, because that's exactly what it's intended to do. You know, to put those vibrations, those healing energies into the hearts of those who require, bring it to their homes, their environment, to those that require, for those that accept it into their life. Because this stuff right here, when I'm telling you, it's all from my personal experience. It's all from what I learned, all from what I'm going through. And all that I'm still learning. And some of the things I got real good at it, but I'm still learning it. There ain't no shame in my game and how I operate, how I move on this planet and how I talk about certain uh, uh, topics that some people don't want to talk about or they might say it's forbidden. All I say is fuck that stuff that people don't desire to talk about that they may be ashamed to talk about or scared or afraid to talk about and just be yourself and express yourself honestly through the body. And that was stated by Bruce Lee. As always, love, joy, peace to all. Take care.